We're hoping we get to keep them for forever, but we're not sure until the adoption finalizes. Just looking around at everything, enjoying the warm bath. That was so strange. That could change a lot of things. You do, Ella. Hey. Ooh, what is that? Telephone? Who would be calling this early in the morning? Oh, I better go get that. I don't want it to wake up the twins. I don't want it to wake up our baby born twins. Hello? The baby doll adoption agency? Yes, we are in the process of adopting. Yes, Elsie and Ella. You'll call back later? Okay. Bye. That was so strange. That's weird. Huh. Well, as you can hear, that phone ringing did wake up our baby born twins. That was quite an odd phone call. That could change a lot of things. Hmm. Well, let's go get those baby born twins up and I'll tell you about what she said. Good morning, sweet twins. Oh, Miss Elsie's awake. Are you waking up, little Elsie? You got one eye open. Oh, come here. Don't cry. They are so sweet. There's two eyes open. Oh, these little girls have been through so much recently. They've had their umbilical cords fell off. And I'll put a little clip of that in here. That was really unusual. Don't be startled with what you see. We just don't want to get an infection. Don't cry. Are you sad too, Elsie? I wonder what could be the matter. Oh my goodness, look, her cord fell off, oh, is that, was that uncomfortable, it kind of slid down into her side, her umbilical cord fell off, now she's all quiet. And then they had tongue tie, laser surgery. They've gone through their first tornado. Oh dear, that is the tornado siren. Oh, the thunder is getting so loud. Okay, I'm gonna get to prep the babies. Oh, here it comes. And I thought the big thing of today was gonna be their very first bath because now that their umbilical cords have fallen off, um, they can actually take a real bath and I hope that bath will go well. That'll be a big thing But after getting that phone call, I Don't think the bath is going to be the biggest thing today That was so odd. I'll tell you about the phone call while we set up for their bath in here is oh He is their bathtub So excited about this they get to try it out for the first time and since we're in the nursery, I thought I'd show you. I have got the whole nursery tidy. If you've been following along on our other recent videos, you'll see that this nursery started out as a disaster. And here it is in all its glory. We obviously need to do a bunch of work. And Dolly friends, it's looking quite a bit better, don't you think? It's not cute, cute yet, but it's at least tidy. Not like the disaster it once was. Okay, but today we're getting a bath going, so 
the baby born twins will hopefully really enjoy it. This is an actual baby born bathtub. And we've given our other baby born baths in it, not Elsie and Ella. So we'll make sure it's just the right temperature, not too hot, not too cold. There, that's just about perfect. And so I was telling you about the phone call. That was the Baby Born Adoption Center. And as you know, we are in the process of adopting the Baby Born Twins. And that was just a call from them. And I haven't heard from them since the twins were born, but they were asking what their names were. And they said that they would call back later today with a big update about their adoption. So I don't know. Hopefully that means some good news about the adoption working out. I mean, you never know for sure until your babies are actually adopted, if it will, and we're sure hoping it does. It honestly makes me a little bit nervous to have heard from them like that because it makes me think that maybe it's not gonna work out and they need their names to move them onto a different case. I don't, I don't really know. Whatever it is, and however the outcome is, whether we get to adopt these babies or not, which we really hope we do, we just want to love them and take care of them every moment that we have them. So we're just going to enjoy this, this special day, babies. not being able to adopt them. There we go. Now before I get them in their bath, I want to show you their umbilical cord site. As you saw before, their umbilical cords came off and their belly buttons have healed just perfectly. Haven't they, Ella? And so has Elsie's. So they're just doing great. Okay, now I've got to figure out how to get both these in the bathtub at the same time. I don't want them to get cold, so I'm kind of keeping them wrapped up in their outfits because sometimes if babies get cold, they'll have a little tinkle accident. I think we have enough excitement for today. We don't need a little accident while we're taking a bath, do we babies? <laughs> we just want their first bath experience to be peaceful and nice and relaxing. No accidents. So the water is nice and clean and warm. There you go. There you go, little girl. Now, come to think of it, I don't know if I've ever given two baby born two baby borns a bath in this bathtub at one time so this may not work the best but we're definitely going to try it <laughs> oh my goodness it's definitely a tight bath for sure but they're doing great i think they're enjoying it getting all comfy can i put this in there yeah there we go oh look at them so fun, babies. Are you taking your first bath? Oh, I think they are. They're just newborns, so they're not going to be too excited in here and splashing. Just looking around at everything, enjoying the warm bath. You too, Ella. A lot of little legs in there. They're just enjoying their time. Ooh, what is that? Oh, Dear, oh no, <laughs> did you babies have an accident in the bathtub? Oh, that is not what we needed today. Uh, okay, what do I do? Two babies, I've got to get them out and get them cleaned up. That is not a clean bath anymore. Babies, we're wanting to get you clean. Okay, yes, this water is definitely yellow 
and I don't think it was just one of them. I think both of you girls. Well, did you like your first bath? Was it kind of a shock? Well, let's get them out of here and get them really clean. Maybe we'll have to try the bath again on another day. Okay, babies, in here. Let's get you all cleaned off here. Yes, that was so dirty, huh? That was so dirty. We'll get you clean. Well, well, one down. One more to go. You nice and clean now. You're gonna have to wait patiently while I help your sister. I think you can do that. Set you right here. And you can just rest. Okay, Miss Ella, we're coming for you. There's that better. Much better. Dolly Fritz, say hi. <laughs> She's still a newborn, so she she doesn't say anything yet. And we'll wrap these sisters. We'll wrap you girls up together now that you're all clean. Yeah, now you're all good. Now you're all tidy and clean. Yes, pretty sure we had an accident <laughs> oh my goodness oh maybe i shouldn't throw this down the sink uh what would you do maybe i should just throw it in the toilet let's throw it over here okay now we'll rinse this out we just like to take really good care of our babies and accidents happen and you know what? We don't have to get upset or stressed out. We just take the next step and get everything clean. We'll try the bath again a different day and hope it works out better. There. All ready for the next bath. And you, my dears, are ready probably for some new clothes, aren't you? How are you getting sleepy? Come on. right here they are looking very sleepy I'll show you the clothes I picked out for them so I have these two Annabelle outfits that should fit them just perfectly and be so comfy so we're gonna get these babies in their nice new clothes I think I'll put Ella in this outfit Do you feel fresh after your bath this is just continue to be a big time in these girls' lives, huh? We're, like I said, we're just hoping we can adopt them. And we've been able to take care of them during this time and love them. And we, we're hoping we get to keep them for forever, but we're not sure until the adoption finalizes. So we're just hoping it all works out. It's your turn, Elsie. Here's your little soft outfit and I'm gonna have to think about how to do bath time better <laughs> I might have to try that again we don't want to have accidents but maybe they just got a little cold or maybe they were squished I'm not sure but that's okay we will figure that out won't we Elsie yes we will been noticing that she often has one eye open and one eye closed. I'm thinking that's just because she's a newborn. Sometimes newborns' eyes will do funny things, but we'll keep an eye on that too because we want to make sure that your eyes work okay. And if she does have a problem, I guess I could call Dr. Tulip and ask him about if there's any concern with that, but we'll just keep an eye on it. I think I'm going to wrap the twins up in this blanket and rock them to sleep while I wait for the call from the adoption agency. I love bundling the twins up together, but I think it reminds them of when they, before they were born and they were always close together. You know, even though that bath had a little extra excitement, I think that it really did relax them and they're going to sleep just peacefully. Yes. 
sweet and precious they are. They're so sleepy. Come here, babies. Oh, that's the phone. I, I, I wonder if that's the adoption agency. Oh, I hope we get to adopt you. Oh, I hope it continues to ring so I can get to the phone in time. Oh, good, it's still ringing. Hello? <gasps> Seriously? Oh. Okay. Wow. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh, my goodness. That was the adoption agency saying that all the paperwork is done and that that the official adoption takes place next week at the courthouse. Oh, we do get to adopt them. Now you're probably wondering more about Elsie and Ella, like when we pick them up from the hospital and all the adventures we've had with them. This is about our new baby born twins. They were born this morning. I'm hoping this diaper bag arrives soon because I need to go to the hospital and pick up our babies. What is this? Let's head to the hospital. Oh my goodness, there they are. Thanks so much to News Toys for sending us these toys for free. You'll never guess what that phone call was just about. That was about our new baby born twins. They were born this morning. We are so excited. We just pulled out our car seats and I was just gathering up all the different things that we had prepared to take to the hospital. But here's the deal. In our last video, I talked about how we didn't have a diaper bag yet and I ordered one and it should be here today. It's scheduled to be delivered today but it's not here yet. But that's not the only thing. I also ordered a surprise diaper bag. They had different diaper bags on the site and they said that there is a mystery backpack and that it was very functional and very large, which I need a large one because we're bringing home twins today that we hope to adopt. So, I'm hoping this diaper bag arrives soon because I need to go to the hospital and pick up our babies. Oh, that's the doorbell. I wonder if that's the delivery of the diaper bag. What is this? Is this our diaper bag? I wonder if there was some mistake. Let's take this inside and see what this is. I mean, seriously, what is this? Let's take, a, let's take a little peek at it. I'm pretty sure that this is a hiking backpack, but it has pink stuff in it. And on this mystery diaper bag that I remember on the description, it did say that it'd be filled with toys, which I thought would just be so cool, but I don't know if this is going to work for twin girls. It's huge, which is nice, but it doesn't look very, it doesn't look like it's for twin girls, maybe twin boys, like a hiking backpack. Hmm. Well, I wonder what toys we got. Oh, how pretty is that? Oh my goodness. What? These are the brand new candy kits from Moose Toys. This is Teeny Tiara. She's so cute. I wonder what else is in here. Oh, here's a big one. Wow. Now this looks like what our baby girls might like. This is Tiara Sparkles. She's like the big sister, I think. And there's another one in here. This is very delish. Wow, down in the bottom there's even more babies. This is Blossom Berry. There's two more. 
another teeny tiara. And here's the last one. Then we have a gigantic empty diaper bag. Well, I'm pretty sure this will fit everything we have to take to the hospital for twin girls. But this was not exactly the style I was thinking. Well, that's okay. It'll work for today, right? We've got to go to the hospital and pick up our babies. Let's go fill up our diaper bag with our baby things. Oh, that's my phone. I wonder what that could be. Oh my goodness. It's a picture that the hospital texted of our new baby twins. Oh, they're so cute. Okay, we really do need to pack up all this stuff and get there and pick them up. I can't believe it. The girls will be so excited. Okay, so I got my phone. Here's the big, the big diaper bag. Oh, I just can't believe it. We are gonna have so much space to put all the twins' things. Um, I do think I'll be having to get another diaper bag. This surprise diaper bag didn't turn out exactly like I was hoping. I'm kind of just thinking of a cute diaper bag. Not so industrial or camping like, but hey, it'll fit all our stuff, so it'll be okay for today. Okay, this. And can't forget the coming home outfits. And they're both. And then we also have their passies and all their bottles. And you know what? We still have so much room in here that I wonder if I, we should unbox some of those moose toys and take them to, oh, is there a spider? Ooh, is it alive? I think it's a dead spider. Oh no, I wonder where this mystery diaper bag has been. I've got to take care of that. It's a dead spider in a web. Gross. Okay, this may not look like a cute diaper bag, but we certainly cannot have spiders on the diaper bag. Okay, we're throwing this in the trash. Bye bye, spider. Okay, well, back to what I was saying. Um, we have room in here. Be fun to unbox a couple of the kindy kids and put them in here because yeah we've got plenty plenty of room so let's go and box a couple of those they look like so much fun we have so many to choose from i think what we're gonna do is unbox the big sister berry delish and the two twin blossom berries let's get started Berry Delish. And what's so fun about her is that she has <laughs> removable shoes. One of them came off, but you can take her shoes on and off. She has big glittery eyes and you can change her clothes. Look at all that pink curly hair. It's so cute and she has little braids. And one of the fun things about Candy Kids is that they're head bobbles. Say hi. Okay, let's get her twins out. So we just set her back there, and here are her twin baby sisters, Blossom Berries. Okay, let's pull them out. Oh, here are the twins. So these little girls, what's fun about them and the little sisters in the Kinney Kid collection from Moose Toys is that they are squishy. So they're very soft, they're almost, I almost feel like water babies. And they have big glittery eyes and they have a removable pacifier. So you can take their passies out, you can take off their bibs and their little outfits here. And if you squeeze them, they blow scented smelling kisses. Wow, that's pretty neat. And their arms and their legs move too. How 
fun and girly are these little twins. And their heads bobble too. Look at them, they're so cute. So now we have big sister and we have the twins. Oh, they're so cute. Let's go add them to the diaper bag. Are you ready to go be the dolls for some other twins that were born? Are they so cute? In you go, Berry Delish number one and Berry Delish number two. Big Sister Blossom Berry. Well, we still have plenty of room in this bag, but I think we have everything we need. So let's head to the hospital and pick up our babies. I'm so excited. I can't wait to meet them. Okay, time to go to the hospital and get our new babies. Well, we just made it to the hospital. And, and I'm just waiting for them to call us back. Just taking a little seat. And hoping they'll call us back soon. We can't wait to meet our new babies and bring them home. This is Kelly. That's us, let's go. baby born twins oh oh can I touch them okay oh, they're so perfect they look just like Kate and Clara did we have names picked out for these babies and we'll share them with you a little bit later in the video oh my goodness and they're sleeping and they're just perfect so tiny I want to hold them. Oh, come here, little baby. Oh my goodness. You are just perfect. Look at how sweet she is. So sleepy. Let's get your twin out. Let's see if I can remember how to do this single-handed. Oh, <laughs> they're new twins. Oh, they're so sweet. Well, we're going to take you home and give you a wonderful place to live. We want to adopt you. They're so sweet. Look at them. Oh, I can't wait to see them when they wake up. Well, I guess we should get them dressed and get you in your going home outfit. You want to go home? Yeah. Okay. Well, first we've got to get into our um, our diaper bag. And oh yes, we've got our babies. We can show them the dolls a little later. But we're looking for going home outfits. Let's see. Here are the bows. They are. There we go. Oh, we'll get you dressed first. I think this little one will dress in this cute, this cute pink onesie with a little lace collar on it. And I'll take off your hat. We've got a bow for you, little girl. Oh, I'm so glad that we have a loving home to take these babies to. We love babies in our family, and my little girls love baby born dolls. I hope you all do too. We're excited about sharing their lives and who they are on our channel with you all. Yes, we are. Who knows what we'll experience with these little girls. I'm sure a lot of adventure. There you go, and it's pretty warm out, so I didn't think we needed any pants. We do need a bow. Let's put your bow on, little girl. There we go. How sweet. Oh, my goodness. How fun is this? New babies. Okay, 
let's get your sister dressed now. Now it's your turn. This is the second one that was born. She's so sweet too. They're, they uh, they must be identical. They look exactly the same. They put two different color bracelets on them to tell them apart. So she has the purple one and this sister has the pink one. Pink little bracelet. So like I said, we'll show you uh, share the names with you all once we take these precious babies home. Are you waking up a little bit? So cute. Yes, you are. And I can't wait to go out and buy some new clothes for them. Actually, I'm planning to go out shopping tomorrow for them. So I'm hoping to find some. Oh, are you waking up? Oh, guys, she has blue eyes. Oh, are you? Oh, she's going back to sleep. <laughs> Sometimes babies are still learning how to, or newborns are still learning how to control both their eyes together. So they do sometimes funny things with their eyes, like open one of them or cross their eyes. But anyway, I'm hoping to go out tomorrow and buy some clothes for them. The new clothes, I think they're in preemie size. So we'll keep our eyes open for those. Here's your little bow girl. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. Come here. Look at how sweet these, oh, and they're almost holding hands. These babies are so cute. Let's take them home. Let's go take them home and reveal their names. Here are their car seats. Come here, babies. Let's take you to your real home. Your real home where you'll be loved. Care for. They might wake up a little bit, but that's okay. You're the one who seems to be kind of awake up easily. Here we go. So cute. Here's the first twin. Oh, there you are. Look at she she has blue eyes too. Oh how fun. Blue eyed girl just like Christy has blue eyes. My oldest daughter. Oh now, before we head home, I think I will put one of the kindy kids with each of them. Okay, back to our gigantic diaper bag. Some are in here. Yes, here she Oh, this is the big sister. We're not looking for her. We're, we're looking for her twin sisters. Feel one of them. Here she is. Oh, there we go. Goes with all the pink we've got going on here. And we'll get one for you, too. One more in here, somewhere in the recesses of this. Yes, yes, here she is. Okay, come here, little girl. There you go. Yeah, now you girls have your new kitty kid dolls. They're too, of course, too young to enjoy them, but they sure look cute together. And I think Christy, Tori, and Emma will love seeing these dolls too. Okay, so time to pack all this up and head home. I haven't gotten over how big this diaper bag is. But perfect for taking twins out and about. Okay, girls, let's go home. Well, look who made it home. And still mostly asleep, these little babies. Welcome to the Kelly family. Let's get you out of here and all comfy on the bed, okay? Yeah, sweet. Okay, let's get you out of here. Oh yes, I know you're a little sad. Come here. So these babies are just brand new. Just born this morning. <laughs> Look at them. They're so little. Open your eyes. Say hi world. Hi Dolly friends. She's so sweet. Look at your sister. I haven't forgotten about you. Oh, look at how sweet she is too. Guys, this is so amazing. We have new babies in our house again. And I promised I'd tell you what their names are. This is little Elsie and her sister Ella. Welcome to our family. And if you're just as excited about baby borns as we are, 
we hope that you have a baby born of your own. And if you're wanting to have ideas of how to prepare properly for bringing home new baby born twins, click on the video in our description below and we'll walk you through all the steps and how we prepare to welcome these little babies into our home. See you on their next adventure.